Muddy, Muddy puddle. Muddy puddle is dry, mommy. <laughs> but what number is this? Nine. Muddy puddle. Oh. puddle. No Muddy puddle. Muddy puddle dry. The Muddy puddle is dry. Muddy puddle gone. To encourage myself that there are only a few stairs left until I reach my flat on the third floor, carrying a constant growing human being in my arms, I was counting my steps. One, two, three, sometimes in English, other times in Romanian, and in this way my little one learned numbers. This was a while ago, and today we are still counting every door number of our neighbor's houses and every pond jetty in the local park. Look, look, the ducks are resting. Wow. Look at mommy, baby bird. Look at baby birds. Can you see the baby birds? Wow. Wow. Look, I baby see. birds. And you found 12. Wash number 15. This activity is great for fine motor skills and it involves no cost. You just need a piece of chalk to draw some numbers and a water pump for your child to wash them. Wash number 8. A small magnetic whiteboard and few markers are great to practice numbers matching. Mix the numbers or leave them in order depending on your child's learning level and play a fun jumping game. I use the foam mat, however you can draw numbers using chalk and play this game in fresh air. 16. Go on the square that has number 5. Correct. Go on the square that has number 12. If your little one is sometimes asking for your phone to play with it, it may be a good idea to download some kids apps that will help him learn different things while playing. Artu loves this uh, Dave and Ava one. This is not a commercial, I paid £3 for it and it's a great learning tool, especially for long car trips as it doesn't require internet connection. Puzzles are a big hit in our house. We started with the wooden ones and getting to more complex ones now. If you want to encourage your child to make puzzles, a good hack is to make them yourself, leaving only one or two pieces for him to add, and then gradually increase the pieces left for him to add until finally he will be able to complete the whole puzzle without any help. Correct. Tu te spune la 18. Correct. 
corect. Și Another great way to practice numbers and to avoid losing pieces of puzzles or sensory books is to count them when put back. On this example, Arthur had to put back 20 fabric pieces of a sensory book after playing with it. Correct? Yes, missing. It's missing? I think you hide, hide it. Last one. 